The boys are absolutely buzzing out here today, and we're feeling some good energy. We're gonna go low. Come on. Yes. Yes. This process started a long time ago. You guys, I mean, you're gonna see some of the process in this video, like the making of it and stuff, but it started a very long time ago. Welcome back to another good, good video. Throughout Good Good, we've we've had all these different like milestones for us. Uh, like first being our apparel launch. Well, actually, first being the actual channel. Obviously, when we launched our channel, we didn't know how it was going to react with the golf audience. Um, we'd seen like on our personal channels and stuff and whatnot there, but. We didn't know how I was gonna react with six guys on camera. Welcome back to another good, good video. We're out here in Mexico, the absolute beautiful TPC I, in Zante yeah. Bay. Uh, it was obviously something completely new to the golf scene, and even for us, completely new. So when we launched that and people ended up enjoying the content, that was crazy. Our next goal was apparel, and when we launched that on April 1st of 2021, I remember it, it had so much hype around the apparel. Like I mean it, yeah. Talk like I seen it, yeah. Live it, cause I dreamed it. You could have did it too, but you didn't mean it. We launched it and we all sat around the computer and we, we were watching the numbers go up and it was it was honestly one of the craziest feelings. Originally it was just we just had little t-shirts. We didn't even have clubs, we didn't have apparel, we didn't have anything. And then all of a sudden we dropped the apparel. When that happened, that is when my mind went. <laughs> I remember when we posted that YouTube video, we were freaking out because all the comments were like, it's so expensive, it's so expensive. But we knew we had faith in our product that once uh, the viewers got the apparel in their hands and were actually able to wear the apparel, they would see that this is a competitive golf brand with any name, any, any big name apparel, golf apparel company out there, it's, it's competitive uh, with the quality and the price. You guys on the other side of the camera have made good, good something that I can confidently say it's kind of blown all our expectations out the water. And I think it's super dope too, because we're just, not to talk ourselves up or hype ourselves up, but we're changing the game. It was very important to me right off the get-go to have something that that anyone could play at a very high level and that anyone could be able to you know take this into a tournament whether you're playing you know Sunday with your boys or you're playing in a US Open qualifier Monday qualifier for any type of tournament I wanted to know that I could use this putter in those type of situations and that I could be able to rely on it and that it would work I've been super impressed with the the process of this all and the, this the what we've gotten to today is is pretty incredible and the quality is absolutely there and this is something that I will absolutely play in whatever tournament situation I'm in this is not something that I that I feel like I'm gonna get into a very high level situation and be like I can't trust the equipment here this is you know something that I can trust if I'm in a Monday qualifier if I'm in hopefully a you know a tour event one day and that to me is just really cool to be able to to be able to have that confidence. We've worked on this for eight months now, just going back and forth with our guy, Kevin. Uh, thankfully, we, we have a, a really experienced club designer working on the putters and working on the manufacturing of the putters to make sure it's the highest of quality we could possibly bring to you guys. Hey guys, uh, Kevin Mayu here, uh, the product designer for the Good Good Golf uh, Putters and uh, some other hard products uh, to come our way. I've been a golf club designer for 12 years now, worked with Adams Golf, uh, we got bought by TaylorMade back in 2012 um, and then transitioned to Wilson Staff in 2015 and I was there for uh, almost five years doing uh, metal woods, putters, irons, uh, kind of a, a lot of um, categories in the club space. And what's really cool about this whole process is, you know, we've been able to interact with, uh, you know, all the guys. They've been testing prototypes. You've kind of seen it on the channel as well. Uh, and what we've kind of landed on is, is, is awesome. Um, 
you know, going through the whole process, coming from working at these major OEMs, there's a lot of logistics you take for granted, like sourcing, you know, where are we going to get these made, the, the sales and marketing, the shipping logistics, you know, the packaging, like all these things that, you know, our team is very lean in this, in this category that, uh, you know, it's kind of a one or two man show to get all this stuff up and running. We have three different models. We're going to have the thicker model here. We're going to have the thin blade and we're also going to have the mallet putter. I can say firsthand the amount of time we put in to designing this, everybody in good, good. We all sat there through the entire process and picked out designs we liked, how we wanted to implement, everything about it. I do love the sleekness of our putter. I love that we've changed it instead of like a normal steel shaft to a black shaft with a blue grip. Um, I love looking down and seeing the dot and the line. In eight months, we were able to design this putter that is usable, and I can confidently say it is a good putter. It's been insane watching the growth from a t-shirt to a golf club. It has been insane. You guys asking questions, you know, when are these going live? Well, obviously now we have a website live. We have a website live. Uh, it's an exclusive website. If you click the link at the top of the description, it, it'll give you all the information that you need about the putter, all the details that you guys want you know all your questions that you want answered it's on the website these officially go live and are launched on the 30th of july um, we're doing a live pop-up shop at neighborhood goods which is in legacy west here in plano texas so we're really excited about it i mean you guys will be able to come out in person test the putters um, on an actual putting green that that we'll have inside of the store and whatnot it's gonna be it's gonna be awesome How you doing? How's it going? I'm good. I'm very good. Mad exciting day today. Is this like my exit interview? Me yeah. leaving, leave me leaving good good? That's what it is. It's so wait, when you ask that question, is it going to be hurt? No, I'm just asking you the question. It's just, oh. just going to be more so you. Do that one more time. Okay, I got okay. it. 